guys. Hi, it's me, Ty. I am so excited to finally be starting to decorate for Ramadan. I've got some, um, some of my old favorites here. I've got these beautiful um, green lanterns. I found these actually at Ross maybe a year or two ago because I was looking for lanterns that were inexpensive. And green is one of my favorite colors. And so I found these beautiful um, lanterns from Ross and they have this huge um, handle and this beautiful green glass with the gold trim and you can just open it. And normally I put um, an LED candle inside. So I have two of those. And then of course my mosques and minarets from um, Days of Eid. I got some more stuff from them. Guys, I am so in love with Days of Eid. They have such beautiful, modern, um, aesthetic uh, Ramadan decorations and just general decorations for your home um, that you can't find anywhere. So um, I really love the style. And so you may see some of their pieces around my house each year steadily adding <laughs> to my collection of uh, decor from Days of Eid. So I've got my mosques and my minarets here, the white ones, and I ordered a few, few more things from them um, that I'm really excited about. These um, little lantern lights here are also from Days of Eid. I got another set of those because I only had one set and it doesn't fit across the mantle and I got these for the mantle so I'm excited about that. All right guys, instead of me yapping, <laughs> I'm gonna get started with this decor. So the little one is gonna kick off the decor by hanging it right here, boo-boo. Mashallah, good job, baby. Mashallah, so pretty. All right, high five. <laughs> I like your ring. Thank you. Is that the wedding ring that you got from daddy? No. <laughs> to our local pop shelf and found some really cool lanterns there. I think these will look so cute next to the green lanterns. And I got two of them. They were only $12 each and I think they will look really nice next to the green ones. <laughs> you want to go put one over by each of the green lanterns? Yeah, I can put them both at the same time. They're not heavy. They're not heavy at all. Yeah, they're, they're tinier than the, these big, heavy green lanterns. One right next to this square. One right next to this one. Does that look good? Very good, Boo-Boo. Good job. I like this section right here. I'm, I'm liking what's going on right here. I found these little florals in my closet and I styled it over here with the little gold lantern. I moved, I ended up moving the green lantern over here. So I made another little vignette over here on this side. I put the other gold lantern and the two green ones. I feel like it's missing something right here. I don't know what that is yet, but when I figure it out, I'll show you guys. But I, I think I'm liking this area okay. We'll see. I'm sure I'm gonna start moving stuff around throughout the month of Ramadan for a whole month until it's over. <laughs> I've lost my helper to chips and drawing. I thought you were helping me. I was just making something for my room. Okay. All right, guys. This was my first attempt at styling the mantle, but unfortunately, I did not love it. So I went on Pinterest for some tips and ideas and planned on restyling the mantle the next day. to 
last few days with a fever. Today I took her to the doctor and uh, they still don't know what's causing her fever. They thought it was COVID um, and um, or strep throat. And so far those tests are negative. So we don't know what she has um, and how long it's gonna take for her to get better. And this happened. This is happening right before spring break. You know. Oh. Sorry, you guys fell down. Um, but and this other angle sucks. But bear with me. We are kind of all over the place right now. I haven't even been, been able to work out, and um, it's it's my schedule is completely thrown off. So um, that's what's going on right now. I'm gonna go get some gas, and then I'm gonna head to World Market. Um, Michael's maybe and pop shelf I also went to TJ Maxx and picked up a vase I shot my house for some artwork and restyled the mantle now I am in love check out my last video decorate for Ramadan with me to see how I did it Hey guys, happy hump day. It is Thursday, March 9th, and today I am working on decorating the house for Ramadan. As you can see right here, I've got my mantle done, and I really, really am in love with it. Um, I had to do some research. I had to find out how to actually style a mantle so that it comes together and looks... Uh, well styled and it turned out really good um i had to go and shop around and find a few things but you know i'll do what i gotta do to get the right look the mantle is a focal point in our house because it's so big and it's so high up um and we spend a lot of time down here we pass through here all the time it was really important to get that set and done and now that that's done i can go and start doing the rest of the first level of the house <coughs> Right now we're in the living room and I um, want to do a setting on the coffee table. So I had to pick up a few things to get this coffee table right. And let me show you guys what I found. It is so cute. I'm really excited to get it done, but let me show you what I found. So here is my big old dark espresso colored coffee table. And I wanted to find like a tray of some sort um, so that I can put a few things on it. I went to Target and I found this beautiful um, brass um, decorative tray. Oh, I found this beautiful tray from Threshold brand for $34.99. And it looks like a hammered, it's not the shiny gold. It's like more of like a hammered brass and I really love it I don't even know if you can see it that well um there we go and it's big enough that it won't get swallowed up by this table and while I'm at it let me show you else what else I got I found this little um this little footed tray by hearth and hand I'm not going to use it here on the coffee table I'm probably gonna use it in the kitchen, which I haven't finished decorating yet, but I thought this would make a good riser for some decorations. So I also got that from Target. Um, so I'm really happy with those pieces I found at Target, but my most exciting find was from Goodwill. In the middle of decorating, I realized that I needed some sort of like books or something to kind of um, elevate some of my smaller items, but I didn't have any, I thought I had decorative books, but I didn't have any. And so I started looking on Amazon for decorative books and they kept showing me the book box, which is like the fake book, fake box that opens up and it looks like a book. And I was like, eh. then I remembered a design tip from one of the YouTubers that I watch or several of them. Find hardcover books, take the jacket cover off. So I went to Goodwill before I went to Target and I found a few books, books that I'm never gonna read 
books that by authors I've never heard of. So I sat there for a good like 20 minutes going through their book section and this is what I found. A Good Distance by Sarah Willis for $1.99. Women Make the Best Friends by Lois Weiss, $1.99. Life Makeover by Dominique Sash, Chasse, whatever. I've Been Thinking by Maria Shriver. I think I know who that is. Isn't that Arnold Schwarzenegger's like ex-wife or something? Yeah, that's her. And then this one was the first, one of the first ones I found. It's called The Dam Keeper. Um, it's a children's book. But I think I'm actually going to keep this for the girls. So, But that was also $1.99. The trick is you find a, a bunch of books. Okay? And you take the jacket cover off. And then you're left with this beautiful cream, white creamish color. And then the gold spine. And I tried to find um, gold le lettering because that's it, that coordinates with my decor. And I tried to find titles that weren't too, like, <laughs> there were some about, like, war and, like, politics and and other things that didn't really fit my decor. But this is fine. So you got this beautiful cream color. And then, let's see this one. Bye, girl. Bye, Dominique. So you see? Look at how pretty that is. Life makeover. I don't know what it's about, but your naked book is really cute. This is more of like a white color. I tried to get books in the same color family. So that they, when I stack them, they look good together. Women, women make the best friends. Okay, take that off. Look at that. With the gold lettering on the side. And you got the beautiful kind of creamy beige color. Okay, and then I think this one is my favorite um, because of the font. Look at this. I love that font. It's so pretty. All right, guys. So, so now you see how they all look together. And I'm going to use them on my tray. I might not use all of them, but I'm going to use them on my tray so that I can style my coffee table. All right, guys, this is how the coffee table turned out. It's simple and elegant. My moon dome jar from Rossum looks great on top of the books. I love how the minaret and candle work nicely on the tray. And the orchid adds something organic and beautiful. Thanks for joining me for this decorating vlog. Stay tuned for part two when I clean and decorate the movie room slash Magilus upstairs. Till next time. Bye. Talk to me nice. Talk to me honestly. Look in my eyes.